Hello guys, thank you so much for coming to this video. Today I'm going to go ahead and review Lance and Dragonite. So let me go ahead and start by showing you the stats. You can see right here. It's going to be 427 attack, uh, 426 special attack, and 265 speed, so that's pretty good. Now, the base damage for Dragon Call is 50, at max it's 60, Hyper Beam is 223, at max is 267, uh, the Sync ability is 250, at max is 300. When it comes down to the support abilities, you have Now or Never, cuts down your HP by half, it's better if you use it when you have low HP, and it gives you full stamina. Then you have Potion, gets you some HP, so that's pretty good. Now when it comes down to the passive abilities, he is actually immune to Paralyze, cannot be flinched, and has Dragon Shift, which this is the bread and butter for Hyper Beam, because Hyper Beam becomes um, Dragon type. Now there are two team compositions that I'm going to go ahead and try for this mission, but I want you to be the judge on this um, actual mission, right? Because I I want to kind of prolong the battle a little bit so that you can see how it's going to work out when a battle is actually going to, to be extended, right? Uh, this is a battle at the long run, right? Um, both teams have very good things, very good... Um, yeah, very good things about him. And some of them, there are some consequences that you lose because you don't have uh, the full benefit. For example, for this team composition, and let me just note, for both of them, I'm going to use the same equipment. It's not maxed out, this is my sub account. But on this account, I have Dragonite, and I don't have it on my main account. So, with this one, you're gonna have two stages of crit. You're gonna have three, um, yeah, yeah, I mean, sorry, two stages of crit, four stages of physical attack, and then six stages of special attack. With this one, you're, you're not gonna have six stages of attack, you're gonna have four. You're also gonna have four stages of speed, you're gonna have six stages of physical attack and then you're gonna have also a hundred percent crit if I'm not mistaken because it's gonna be three st stages but somehow um, I didn't hit a crit well I had three stages so it, that's something that I can figure out why and it was not against someone who has protection against crits so let me just go ahead and jump into the battle right because I, I don't want to prolong uh, the video unnecessarily. I mean, I want you to be fast and sweet, right? Fast and sweet. I'm gonna choose this battle. I'm gonna choose this battle uh, just because I like it and also because I need to do this mission. <laughs> I need to do this mission. So I'm gonna go ahead and start by buffing myself and casting my first unbuffed uh, Hyper Beam. Then I missed, so that's sweet. That's sweet. But it's fine, I mean, we have a lot of stamina. Uh, regain rate, right? So here we go. Nice. So at this point, this is where I prolong the battle, okay? Because I want to see... I want to see how much damage I can dish out with my sync ability. I actually didn't check how many stages of uh, physical attack I had, but I believe I, I had full. Full six stages, I hope so. And also, the speed in which you recover your stamina, it's very consistent. It's very quick, it's very nice. Sweet and simple, right? 
Now I'm going to move to the other team composition, which is very popular as well. I'm sorry about that. It's going to be the same mission, but in this case, I'm going to use the second team composition. Now just FYI, with this team composition, you don't get full crits and you do not get full attack. So that's, that has to be said, right? But nonetheless, we're gonna buff as much as we can to get the most out of my buffing team, right? My support. Now the good thing about this is that I haven't missed, so that's pretty awesome. Nice. Now I'll, I'll just use my sink. Now look at the speed in which I recover my stamina. It's a little bit different than the other team. Now he, he survives with 1 HP, which is just perfect to, to show an example, right? So let's see. Now I know you can use now or never. That's, I mean, that's there. But I just wanted to show how, I mean, I'm not gonna say that either or it's a bad option, but if you wanna get the best out of it, I strongly believe that the first team composition, it's better. The only thing that you lose is two stages of a special attack but in exchange, you get one more stage of crit, you get two more stage of physical, which is for your sync ability, and then you also get four stages of speed, which at the long run, it's a good thing to have, because it allows that stamina gout to refill smoother. Guys, I'll let you be the judge, but I would like to ask you, if you would like to participate on this video, I usually don't ask for any participation, but I would like to know from your point of view, even if it's one or two comments, which team do you think it's the best? Thank you for watching this video and please enjoy your day.